winter storm holds Denver in its grip and for the second time in just a week. Travel nearly at a standstill. Chris Parente with Affiliate Station KWGN is joining us now live. Hey there, Chris. I, I'm understanding that I-70 is now closed and a, a big chunk of I-25, like nine miles or so of that, also closed. So people are sort of being told, hey, take a four-day weekend. Oh, you know it, Heidi. Boy, oh boy, here we go again. It is round two, Denver versus Mother Nature. Hopefully, this time around, we do a little better. You'll recall last week, the whole city was shut down, paralyzed by that major blizzard one week ago. This morning, it is considerably better. Take a quick look here at our major north-south artery. That's I-25, north and south. We have the full fleet, 35 plows on the roads this morning, keeping the lanes open. For the first time in the city's history, they've hired 35 private trucks and jeeps with plows to work the neighborhoods keep those lanes open as well we're told the bus schedule here in the city is regular running full capacity this morning out at the airport you recall last week the whole place shut down thousands of travelers stranded this time around the airport is still open there are of course still plenty of delays out there united saying they have canceled 125 flights this morning alone uh, but they are hoping to get back to regular flight schedules by sometime after lunch in the meantime, between these two storms, last week's and last night's, Denver's seen almost two feet of snow. And the lingering effects of one of the big ones is trash collection. Trash is piling up all over town because the trucks can't get to it. We also have a lot of side roads that are still impassable. And if you've been to the grocery store lately, you know there are no eggs, no milk, no bread, a lot of run on the area grocery stores as well. Officials are hoping if Mother Nature cooperates, Things could be back to normal here in Denver Metro by the first of the year. We're keeping our fingers crossed. And in the meantime, Heidi, as I'm sure you know there in Atlanta, one of the upsides to this kind of heavy snowfall here in Denver is a good old-fashioned snowball fight. It's a way to relieve some stress, and if somebody's angry at you, they can take it out in a relatively nonviolent way. Ow. <laughs> back to you guys. It hurts. Ow. Hey, you know, we're just going to stay on this shot for a while, Chris. See what happens. No, please. Come on, get him. I'll get him back, Heidi. <laughs> oh. All right, Chris Ferrante. weather out here. All right, the best live shot of the day. Appreciate it very much. Uh, we will stay on top of the story, even though you are running for your life, apparently.